Hello, Internet! This is Bone Carlos coming to you live from the first leg of the Eliminator Bring You Another Vlog type thing. Before we get started, I'd like to point out that my giveaway is still in the way. One of the games has been guessed, and all that information is going to be down below alongside with the hint of the week. This week's topic is going to be brought to you by RVB Kabuserb. And he wanted me to talk about Mike Tyson versus Bruce Lee, both both in their primes, obviously. But before we get started into that topic, I'd like to point out that I am making a kind of adjustment to the way I do these videos. Before, I would find the gameplay and then uh, make my commentaries to fit the length of time of that video. But I, it wasn't really in the spirit of what I wanted to do with these videos. So what I'm doing now is pre-recording them and then finding uh, gameplay footage to match. Uh, kind of similar to what the length of the commentary is. Um, it's, there's not going to be much difference to you guys, but for those keeping at score, that is what I'm doing. Also, 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 a couple days ago, I was playing free for all, you know, leveling up my weapon for the weapon optimization vids, and generally just playing video games. And I came across a free for all lobby where we were just having a, a great time. And I like to give a shout out to those players uh, that we were playing along with. And it's going to be Thor, Reaper, Chosen One, Rob, and Overlord. It was great. It was fun, and I thoroughly enjoyed playing with you guys we did have um a good understanding of what everybody did we were just kind of it was just like the basic just making fun of each other but more importantly we were having fun um and that's what i feel our video games are all about there wasn't any uh bad apples in that group uh, no one complained no one was doing all that good stuff and we were just kind of ribbing on each other and just enjoying each other's company while playing some call of duty so um games like that are few and far between and when i notice that i like i just like to point that out um whenever possible so that's it for that also oh yeah yeah yeah. if you guys want me to do a commentary anything anything at all leave a comment down below and i'll be happy to take care of it if there's multiple um suggestions i'll go ahead and take one that's more interesting to me or one that gets some more thumbs up so if you guys are scrolling through my comments to see something that you'd like for me to talk about that someone already mentioned it give it a thumbs up and the one with the most thumbs up will um win uh quote unquote win uh the chance for me to talk about it so that's it for that. Uh, I took care of all that good stuff. Let's go ahead and get into Mike Tyson versus Bruce Lee, um, which is very interesting choice and a very interesting question. Actually, uh, my initial response is to say Mike Tyson, just for the fact that he's bigger than Bruce Lee and he's going to be stronger than Bruce Lee. But I kind of curtailed that train of thought and kind of did a little bit of a research. Usually I do these off the cuff and don't really do that much research, but I figured I don't want to uh, diminish the legacy of Bruce Lee uh, or have Mike Tyson find me and kill me because I'm so popular on the net that I, my opinion and my stories have any uh, impact on the real world. But uh, needless to say, I did do a little bit of research and I came up with uh, a kind of interesting stories on both Bruce Lee and Mike Tyson. Now, uh, physically, physically, uh, they're about the same height. I mean... Mike Tyson is about two to three inches uh, taller than Bruce Lee, while and he also outweighs him. Best estimates, he outweighs him by about 50 pounds. I think Bruce Lee Kim is quoted as coming in around 155, 160, while Mike Tyson in his prime was around 210, 220 ish, depending on his uh, training regimen. So uh, d Mike Tyson obviously has the size advantage, but. Uh, reading up on Bruce Lee, uh, that wasn't really a problem for him. He fought uh, guys bigger than him, guys stronger than him all the time, and came out victorious. But the same can be said about Bruce Lee as well, So, or I mean uh, Mike Tyson as well. So um, this just comes to just looking at these two guys and seeing who would win in a fight. And as saying that I, in Mike Tyson is his prime, I never really watched any kind of Mike Tyson boxing matches because by the time he kind of fell out of favor with uh, the boxing world, I was about 8, 9, 10 years old. And uh, Bruce Lee, I think, was dead by the time I was born. So I can't really base anything on personal experience, but right off the bat, just seeing what uh, Bruce Lee can do and what it was reported that he could do, uh, I would just go ahead and give the favor to Bruce Lee uh, just because he was just faster. Uh, his training was just so much better, uh, and really they were both kind of uh, rageful fighters. I mean, reading up on the stories about Bruce Lee, there was a, a bunch of times where people were say he would get angry, and that was just surprising. I never figured Bruce Lee was the type of guy to get angry, but according to stories, he was. He would get angry, he would get mad, and he would fight. And um, with uh, Mike Tyson. He if it was like if it was a straight up boxing match, I still would give the the 
I would still give the the favor to Bruce Lee since there, he was actually an amateur boxer at one point. And if it was just a no holds barred quote unquote MMA fight, I would definitely give uh, the, the advantage to Bruce Lee just because he's a, a martial artist. He could use kicks. He could use holds, uh, stuff like that. And and something that I do not think Mike Tyson knows much about. So um, that that's it for that. Uh, I'm gonna have to give my. Um, my hat and tip the hat to Bruce Lee. I think he would be able to take on Mike Tyson, even though he does, uh, he is uh, smaller than him in height and weight. So that was it. I hope you guys enjoyed. If not, leave a comment down below on what I could do to make these more enjoyable for you. Good, bad, whatever. I don't care. Leave those comments. Um, yeah. Other than that, I'm gonna get on out of here because apparently I gotta go climb a big ass rope wall. <laughs> whatever. Later, guys.